In this video, I will explain why there is a lack of uh, gaming videos in Edipo channel, Edipo YouTube channel. The reason is in 2021 and a majority and a majority of 2020, year 2020 and year 2021, there is a lack of good games. I can't believe the games that have just come out are so bad. They are not even worth playing. Now, some games, most games these days, have tried to rehash the same thing over and over and over again. An example is, for example, you have the uh, Call of Duty same game rehashed over and over again and even in 2021 the quality is not as good as before of course you have the new consoles the PS5 console the uh, Xbox X but the gameplay and the graphics are just incremental incremental improvements if you pre if you play the previous iteration of their games you are basically playing the same thing the exact same game just minor tweaks like the the place where you are fighting and the enemies are the same you just uh, fighting hordes of enemies with the same basic AI and most be most companies are just basically copying each other. Now, Fortnite came out with the Battle Royale. Basically, a lot of players uh, attacking each other, and the area becomes smaller and smaller, so that in the end there is only one winner. Now, this uh, thing has been rehashed in almost all the first person shooter games even Call of Duty and um, Battlefield 2042 and even EA uh, came out with um, their game their version so basically it's just a rehash now what I like are games that are uh, unique and I also like open world but I like open world that are not rehashed like for example um, Final Fantasy started the good open world games and you can say Metal Gear Solid uh, 5 V uh, was one of the best that there that there is in this type of gear. Now there are copycats that try to uh, enter this uh, arena, and mostly um, the early days of open world that are okay is probably by Ubisoft. Now their Assassin's Creed games are kind of define the, the, the genre so basically you explore and then you climb a high tower and that uh, reveals more of the map now uh, even Nintendo is copying and they came out with Breath of the Wild and where you are also climbing to the top of towers and uh, that reveals more of the map where you can explore and fight more enemies and of course they added uh, super bosses uh, to keep you uh, satisfied along the way um, or it becomes monotonous but one thing I want to talk about is uh, Metal Gear Solid now that was one of the best open world games it had uh, unique characters it had unique gameplay 
and most importantly it had unique gameplay mechanics that you can uh, ex uh, experiment with and uh, explore different combinations of uh, the uh, weapons in with the environment for example one of the earlier Metal Gear uh, solid games uh, is that when, when you shoot at ice cubes uh, to make them fall out of the bucket, the ice bucket, they started melting. And if you were to throw enemies in the water and you shock the water, uh, the enemies get shocked. So these things where the environment and the weapons you use, there are sort of a related game mechanic that makes the game uh, worth experimenting on to see what could happen if you combine this uh, tool or this weapon in this circumstance. And what will happen if you use, like for example, in, Mid in MGS5, if you use the uh, water gun on quiet or the skulls so these experiment experimental game mechanics uh, makes the game more exciting more uh, it allows you to uh, keep playing over and over again and not be bored but for example Assassin's Creed once you've uh, played one version of Assassin's Creed, the rest are usually the same. You are playing the same game. All they do is just change the location and maybe substitute a, a new uh, boss fight. But basically the same thing. You just climb towers, unlock more areas, and do the same thing over and over again. That is a game that is not uh, exciting but back to the main point that is the reason why this channel has not been releasing a lot of games because in the uh, 2020s and uh, 2020 in the year 2021 I have not seen any game that's worth playing it's basically the same thing I wanted to get the new Assassin's Creed that uh, uh, we, that relates to the uh, uh, Vikings but um, I didn't get that uh, because I thought I think it's the same thing it's the same rehash and the rare reviews where you just do things over and over again after you have uh, cleared um, one of the early mid missions the rest are just the same thing uh, trying to get out of England and I do not want to grind through all that just so you can say you completed it. I want some games where uh, Kojima like games or games where you can explore and uh, interact with new game mechanics you can ex experiment sort of like um, Minecraft merge with open world games so that's what I'm hoping in the future I hope there are people who spend more time playing with different uh, techniques of combining uh, game mechanics with their environment allowed allow a lot of Easter eggs where certain circumstances will maybe unlock secrets or unlock different animations or not I, I actually don't like animations special animation I like special circumstance circumstances where you can create uh, new not create but uh, unlock new game mechanics um, it's, it's just like the old uh, uh, the first Zelda game where once you uh, get the bomb you realize you can blow apart all the different walls and see what's behind them so in future games maybe you can get a uh, a, a sort of just like Zelda where you get a tool that can break apart a wall 
and you can start entering these buildings that in the beginning you could not enter or maybe you get a, a, a catapult uh, later in the game where you can reach buildings that are very high that you could not in the beginning and that will unlock open up places where you can explore it makes the game more exciting during the second half or the third half of the game after you obtain special tools or, or game me mechanics uh, that makes the game more interesting otherwise these current games that are released I don't like them and I don't like the idea of buying the game, same game twice just to get a few more features I hated it that the uh, Death Stranding that to get the director's cut you need to purchase you have to pay more just just for the racing part and just for one mission that resembles a stealth so I didn't get that I also can, didn't get the, the Final Fantasy 15 um, the Final Fantasy XV expansion where you can uh, get uh, more missions later with the um, uh, side quests for these uh, other characters I didn't get that either I bought the main game I enjoyed it I'm not gonna pay more just for a few missions and just play replay the whole missions again just for uh, just just to, for them to make a uh, more profit so that's basically my gripe and that's the main reason why in this channel eDepot channel you are not seeing any good uh, gaming videos lately is because the games really really suck and um, there is not much I don't want to rehash the same gameplay it's boring maybe I've outgrown it but uh, or maybe the, the because of the pandemic the companies are basically making rehashes of earlier games like for example Rockstar makes the um, rehash of of all their earlier earlier uh, games GTA uh, games I am not gonna buy um, all those earlier games and just just make some graphic enhancements but it's basically the same horrible gameplay from yesteryear so bear with this channel and um, once good games come out you will start seeing good videos good gameplay videos but in the meantime uh, I have other interests I just got into cryptocurrencies I will make some videos of those and so in the future I think that is important I also make uh, if I see some game that are worth it I will make some so hope you enjoy this video and I hope the, the situation improves Please give video a like and please subscribe and thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.